thing, but not quite as harsh. Hello YouTube, this is your girl Miss Sasha LaRue coming to you live and direct from the East Coast. Now that would be the city of brotherly love and sisterly affection. Ting, 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 tong, ting. How's everyone doing this cold, chilly, didn't get a snow day but it snowed evening. Hmm. Um, today is Tuesday, December the 10th, and um, I guess this would be, oh heck, I don't know, month 15, Going, this is month 15, the 25th will be the 15th month, I don't know what week, and who cares, it is today. Um, I started this journey, as we all know, 15 months ago, September 25th, 2012. Highs recorded weight was 303. Um, day of surgery was like 282. Last time I talked to you, I was uh, 186, which was, I guess, maybe the 19th of November. That's what I have in my, that's the last time I recorded it in my phone. Um, so, the 19th of November was 186, and today, the 10th, 178. So, since the last time I recorded it and put it in this book, in this phone, um, is an eight pound loss. But so many things that went on in that eight pounds that it is whatever it is. Um, you know. So, um, as of this morning, I lost a total of 125 pounds since the beginning of my journey, which was actually September 10th, 2012. So there goes a um, common number, um, date. And then 108 pounds um, since weight loss surgery, which was the BSG. Um, things are going pretty good. Um, so let's see, what, is, what, has, what have I done since the last time we spoke? I had my class reunion. Well, not my 1985 class. It was my high school reunion. The high schools of the town that I grew up in, which was two of them. One was Kennedy High School and one was Willingboro High School. I'm a Willingboro High School girl, graduate. Um, so what they do is they get a whole bunch of the you know old timers from the class of 78 all the way down to the class of 86. So it's a, I don't really know too many people older. These older people was a whole bunch of Kangos and just interesting cats out there um you know hanging to them you can tell they got their you know so you can you can just you, you know what i'm talking about it's just them people it was, it was lovely it was nice um ran into a lot of people who had not seen me in a long time um got a good reception from everybody really um everyone that i ran into i've it's amazing uh you know, I, people who watch you and you don't even know that they're watching you or seeing you, you know, you put so many things on Facebook and talk so much junk and everything like that is it's funny when people, you know, you got the people who sit back and, and they do see it and they watch and they comment and I got a lot of, um, a lot of that, a lot of, um, people asking for advice, um, and just, you know, these are, some, some were, you know, um, big, the, the sports guys, the football players, and the old basketball players, and, you know, they all look great, though, everyone looked really good, and it was good seeing everyone, and, um, it was nice, um, I have my, my job's Christmas party coming up, this Thursday evening, um, which will be uh, hopefully the last event, you know, holiday event that I have to go to socially, that I'm actually looking forward to going, um, which is kind of strange because although I have always been a social person and always like to go to a party, um, you know, you always get that feeling when you're carrying so much of you in that party for so many years, I, I, you know, hung out as a large person, woman, and I'm, you know, you get self-conscious about when you walk into a room and things, so I'm, um, you just feel self-conscious about those things, so it's not as, you know, so either you have to be overly jubilant and jovial to hopefully make people not see that you're close to 300 pounds and just please accept me for who I am. 
um, those kind of feelings. And now that you're feeling good, you're looking better on the outside, um, the body is doing what it's doing as a reaction to, as a result of what you're doing to it to make it look a certain way. So you're getting to feel more confident. And but then when you, you're out there, it's like you still kind of feel like you're carrying that weight with you. Because in here, um, it, the mental is still catching up with what's going on the outside. What I'm finding that when I sit back and relax and enjoy it, or how should I say, not necessarily enjoy it, but just kind of sit back and, and um, enjoy the ride, I guess. Hell yeah, you just enjoy the ride and, and you take note of these things and the things around you. You know, the, the saying, take time out to smell the roses. Well, when you're taking time out to smell the roses, um, that means you're having a good time. You're walking somewhere that looks good. And you're at a good place in, in your life. So even though things may be falling down around you and, um, you know, shit that would just break, you know, Goliath's back, okay? Even though you're going through that, you can still take time out to enjoy these little simple things and just enjoy the changes. And the changes are, are interesting, you know? Um, they're, they're interesting, to say the least. I'm happy. Sometimes I catch myself being happy, like, hey, you're happy over there. And it feels good. Uh, I had a good day today. I laughed a whole lot today. Um, today was the snow. Anybody in the northeast area here, in the tri-state area, and I'm sure up in Connecticut too, um, you know, got some snow. So it was fun, but I still had to go to work. My whole, my family, they got to stay home today. I had to go into work, um, which was still okay. It was fun, you know, coming out with the snow and just, just enjoy it. Just suck it up, buttercup. Um, but yeah, so everyone was funny on Facebook from the beginning to the end, um, from the salty cowboy fans to just the crazy antics of our community, um, <laughs> uh, just having fun with each other, which is cool. Um, I got a chance, oh yeah, Saturday, me and Dawn, um, did this journey, went down, drove down to Atlantic City, and we got to meet and see Marlene, which is our bandster for life, um, Yvonne, I don't know her, um, YouTube channel name, but I've, I've seen it, we subscribed to each other finally, I've been seeing her beautiful face, like, here and there all over, um, the community, um, but just never got to her channel, so now I'm taking the time out, and, um, um, we're getting familiar with each other. It was wonderful meeting her. I met Grenon Be Gone, Aisha, um, which was really nice to meet. Um, it was nice to meet everybody. Um, Banster, um, I enjoyed her. She and Yvonne, everybody, everybody was cool. And um, we had a nice trip down, me and Dawn, and we had a nice trip back. Good conversation, good unity. Um, and great uh, support and um, different views, you, you know, not different views, but different um, ways of looking at things and hearing other people, you know, talking. And so it was really nice to um, form a, a nice friendship and um, kind of like seal the deal like, yeah, you know, it, it was good. You are, you know, we, I had a good time. So thank you, ladies, for um, coming down and making it easy so we, could, you know, that we can meet. So, and that was good. Um, what else? Really nothing else, really. Um, I guess you guys are wondering what the hell she's got this cowboy hat on. I don't know. I love, this is my Shady Brady. And this Shady Brady is old. It's got to be at least... They survived by burning the Jeep's 25, tire to stay warm. 25 years they old, um, that, that since I had it, and it came from my Uncle Jasper down in Georgia, and he gave it to me when I was, you know, 25 years younger, and, and, and he probably had it for like maybe 10 years before that. But this hat is broken in, it's been seen some time, and I love hats, and um, I enjoy hats, and I have a whole closet full of different kind of hats. So, I don't know, I just seen it sitting there, I said, you know what, I'm going to put it on, and we'll get on my horse. Sometimes you got to change your hats. Maybe there's a message in there somewhere. Oh, well, it's almost 10 minutes, and I just wanted to get on here quickly and give you guys some love, tell you guys hello, um, let you know that your girl's doing fine. I'm enjoying the ride. 
I'm enjoying me. I'm enjoying life um, and all that God placed in mind, um, from the great friends um, to just learning new things and just having a good time doing it. Um, all is well. And um, I hope you guys have a good night. Talk to you later. Bye.